Hello everybody and how are you doing today? Good, bad, well guess what? I don't care. So today we're going outside the base because we got exploring to do. In my hand I have five vehicles that I am going to demonstrate to you today. So you might be asking, what are vehicles? Why are they so important? Well vehicles in decimation are used to travel about long distances. And because if you can't travel there in fast enough time, you may lose a supply drop. Now, how do you get around with these things? Well, you need two things. You need the vehicle, and you need the fuel can, which is called jerry can. What is a jerry can? Well, a jerry can right here is something that holds gasoline, which powers a vehicle or fuels a vehicle to keep it moving. So we're going to go through these list of vehicles, why each are important, and how its strategic value is absolute. So the first one right here is an AC. It's a two-man seater. Is usually used for stealth runs, and its horn sounds like this. It also is pretty fast, so check it out. I can run over animals and slaughter them. want to get slaughtered today so yep that happened next we have the buggy much bigger vehicle still still stews teeter nothing has changed really and you can't exactly see I would say not really worth investing into unless you have citizens but overall fun little car I think it's very interesting, to say the least. And it actually has a weird ass one. Aside from that though, pretty useless. Next, we have the Hummer. And now, the Hummer, you're gonna get more tactical use out of this. This is mainly for more of, I have a squad and I need to move them all. So, see this as military use. Right here we have five slots in where we can store people. We've got the upper deck, we've got the back seat, right seat, top right, and then the steering wheel. Overall, neat car. There's a horn for it. Moves incredibly fast. And if I remember correctly, no, it does not kill animals. So overall, good vehicle, can't complain about it and should definitely be used if you've got more than one people joining next we have the m35 truck this is primarily used if you have tons of people so about eight or nine or ten in a squad and say you want to transport large amounts of people well not to worry your truck is loaded and ready to go you've got eight seats in the back one up front and one to drive. And the horn sounds like this. And you've got a bit more viewing space. It's got a quieter engine. So overall, I'd say this vehicle is pretty good. And it's got smoke. So overall, I would say a pretty tactical, pretty interesting logistical vehicle. And finally, we have the APC. Now, the APC is the most deadly motherfucker of them all. And why I say motherfucker? Well, I don't put this lightly, ladies and gentlemen. This thing has ammunition that can rip open somebody's pussy in three inches. And if you think I'm joking about that, well, you're about to see why. So, you need $50,000 for just the ammunition of this thing. And in-game, this will cost $1.53 million cap. Not not golden caps, just bottle caps. And this is what the box looks like. You go away. I don't need you anymore. Actually, I'm going to put all these away. And I will make sure to put up the price for them. So, anywho. This is the tank. 
There are different positions in it. Uh, lots of back storage for people to travel in. But your main value is this. And when you left click with it, you can shoot things. does a lot of damage so I would highly recommend getting one of these once you get on the main servers but yeah that's about it um main message vehicles are awesome and you gotta love them all get an APC because you can flex on your friends that's about the end of that I hope everyone has a good day my name is Hypnosian and I will see you later